Hi there. Hi, how's it going? What's your name? Matt Hubbard. Hi, Matt. Tell me about your musical history and why you're here at the Austin Music Awards 2013. Well, it's I hardly know why I'm here, actually. <laughs> I moved here in 94 after going to Oberlin Conservatory. Uh, just some friends and I moved down. They've all since left, but since then I recorded Willie a lot in his recording studio and was in Fastball, this little rock band in, in town for briefly, and I uh, played with a lot of people in town. Uh, in the past few years, I've been in Seven Walkers as a, a jam band with George Porter Jr. from the Meters, Papa Molly, and from the Killer Bees, and, and Bill Kreutzman from the Grateful Dead. And, um, and actually, we have a little time off this year, so I've been around town, and I'm the newest member of Greasy Wheels, which is getting inducted in the Austin Music, uh, Texas Music Hall of Fame today. So that's why I'm here at the Austin Music Awards. <laughs> nice. Yeah, it's been a fun, fun journey, definitely. I well, play uh, Wurlitzer electric piano, trombone, and harmonica in the band, so it's fun. Really? In the Greasy Wheels band? Yeah. But you also say you're a recording engineer. Yeah, I helped uh, Willie with his little recording studio out in Luck, Texas. Um, done a lot of stuff, like tons of overdubs that he does with other artists, and some other records and family-related projects, but benefit songs and whatnot. And, uh, I recorded the Seven Rock Walkers record and done engineering throughout town, but I guess I also um, I've always wanted to play a lot of instruments because I did record and sometimes when you need a bass player and they're not around, you, you know, it's more convenient to, to do it yourself and whatnot. So sure. I think the recording and playing a lot of different instruments when, uh, you know, developed together well as I was growing up in junior high and whatnot in high school. So. so from a producer standpoint and a musician standpoint, what's your favorite thing to do, play or produce? Um, I mean, I think playing music and listening to it is all, you know, my favorite thing, but it's all the same really, you know, I just love music and no matter whether you're listening to it, I love uh, pushing record or putting the mics up and I guess there is not one favorite part, but I mean, I might, I guess my first love was playing the piano since I was a little kid, so I would have to go back to that, you know, ultimately. And I've, and actually, you know, the reason I play Boogie Woogie Blues piano quite a bit is because uh, when I was younger, I was reading some uh, books by, um, George Carlin, the famous comic, you know, he's a real smart guy, um, obviously very talented and intelligent and stuff, and he said if he had any wish in the world, he would want to play Boogie Woogie Piano, and I was like, wow, for someone I respect so much, you know, I, I could actually do that, so I sort of kept pursuing it a little bit more, so it's kind of fun. Yeah. Excellent. And you've done well for yourself. Well, congratulations Thank on this you. evening. And you're the newest member of, of this band being yeah. inducted tonight, aren't you? So yeah, I mean, it was funny, like I joined the band and then they're like, hey, we're all getting the award and you are too. And I'm like, great, <laughs> <laughs> it's cool with me, whatever. You know. But uh, yeah, the band's been around since the 70s. They played at the Armadillo World Headquarters. You know, The violin player played with uh, Jerry Garcia and Frank Zappa, they had a famous jam here in town and stuff. So there's some good history in the band. It's nice to be a, a, a part of that. So. Excellent. Thank you so much. Well, thank you for being with us. And congratulations. Thanks.